Okay, today what we're going to do is we're going to align two files that are scaled properly on the beforehand using the xref command. So let's go ahead and get started. Again, I have level four here, which uh, is missing a few pieces of line work that was actually delivered to me in a different drawing. So this is the other drawing that I received. Again, grid lines are the same. Um, again, the scale is the same, but again, I just want these walls on level four. So let's go ahead and attach this external reference or this other DWG file to my main file, which is level four. I'm gonna go ahead and press X, R, E, F and press space. I'm gonna go up to the top here. I'm gonna attach DWG file and we're gonna do this right here and press OK or open. Now we're gonna press OK. And here is my other file right here. Again, it's just following my mouse around. You can try to align it if you want to here. It might be a little challenging, so I'm just going to click my mouse and it's going to stake it right here. Um, it is all one block, so if I click on it once, the entire thing highlights, which is fine with me at this point in time. Um, I'm going to just type the letter M and spacebar. And we're going to find a nice little open space here, maybe right here at this grid line intersection. Again, I know both files are already, uh, already scaled properly. So we're just going to go ahead and drop this right back onto this drawing right here. And now if, as, I, as I zoom out, let's kind of get this out of the way really quick here. Let's move it over. Now I have the walls or interior wall section or drawing on top of my level four drawing. Um, they are not completely binded yet. Again, a really cool feature about doing the XREF is you can actually unload this file and look around to make sure it's in the right place. And then you could reload it just like that. The last thing I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and say, hey, everything looked great. And I'm going to go ahead and bind those two files together into one, just like that, and go ahead and get this out of my way. And then again, remember, everything is under uh, basically one block reference. So I'm going to go ahead and maybe just see if I can click somewhere just like that. And I'm going to press X and enter. And now we are ready to do W block and save this thing. So we're going to go ahead and highlight the drawing already. We're going to go WB, enter or space bar. And I'm going to go ahead and change the name. Maybe we're going to do level four and then maybe a line. And we'll push save, see how that works. And we're going to go to OK. Perfect. So we are good to go. Thank you very much.